Hello and welcome to Tangle in Sync session. So this week we are playing with yet another Tangle pattern. If you are here for the first time, let me introduce myself to you. I am Aishwarya Tharba. I am a certified Zentangle teacher. I have been practicing Zentangle past 5 plus years and I have been teaching Zentangle art uh, since last 2 years. Um, so we have almost completed our one year and uh, three months f um, on the YouTube sessions. I conduct regular workshops, be it beginners or even advanced classes. So you can contact me at my website tangleandinspire.com. You can go through the course list if you want to take up anything. Or um, and also yeah. Uh, you can purchase all the Zen supplies that I'm showing on the videos and also that they are available on my website. Um, everything is available with me. Shipping is anywhere within India. So you can shop at tangleinspire.com slash shop. You can find all the details in the description below. So let's start today's fun. Okay. <laughs> So that was the little thing I wanted to say and uh, so we'll be playing with a new tangle um, I, I mean we have already played with the tangle but uh, we didn't explore it well so I am coming up with a mono tangle session so we'll be playing with only one tangle today and I'll be using my micron oven pen and a little bit thicker nib is micron O3 okay so I'm going to use both the pens and uh, I'm going to use my tortillon okay and I have just you know use the blade and sharpened it to the point and uh, I'm using my 2B pencil this is this is from the Zentangle a tiny and a very uh, comfortable one to the hands for yourself to create this beautiful art I'm going to start with the four dots so that's the traditional way of starting a zentangle art and then I'm going to connect with a random line okay so you can see that I'm deliberately keeping my lines crooked and this will this gives a nice fun and interesting movement So I'm going to use the whole part for today's um, tangle, okay? So we're not going to draw any string or anything. I'm just going to start. So I'm using my O3. You can use any pen, even O1 is fine. And I'm going to start adding dots okay it's a nine giving about half an inch distance you can see it in the pen okay yes it's a half size half the cap size okay so i think one more i'm going to fit it here and then I'm going to just eyeball it and create these dots even if it is not too perfect or straight that is okay you can do it slowly you can rotate your tile you can see that how I am just eyeballing and tracing it just one step at a time with a C curve okay and then an inverted C and make it a nice deep C curves all in the same way just vertically and I'm going to do the same thing over here as well just mimicking it right 
hold your pen gently don't press it too hard allow the ink to flow and let the pen nib guide you so now i'm gonna create same c curves here so i'm gonna start like this and then again deep one then again the top one and again set to the deep one and i'm going to go with the same stroke okay i'm going to mirror it just exactly the same i'm not going to put any different direction all have to go in the same direction so tangle starts very much like a huggings or we use it in the cadent but the step outs are very different and the end results are very interesting it's a beautiful triangle introduced by Annie Annette I don't know I think Annie or Annette right so if you don't get five, uh, five rows or just four rows are okay now just take your O3 pen right and I'm going to aura inside them okay so you can watch me to press slightly a bit and make this line thicker so this is the very easiest way to have thick lines is to change the pen though I don't recommend you to do that always but sometimes for quicker results this is easier okay so since we did aura here so we're going to do aura over here as well just go along with the shape at this moment just relax feel comfortable in any pace you are if you feel my hands are moving too quickly you can pause the video so you can see that I'm always rotating the tile hmm? just to get my comfortable so now I'm gonna do on the other side as well and we use the same pen I'm sorry The shadows are not too much. Not too strong. You are able to see my hand. So you can see that not everything is perfect. You just have to go 
with the shape that we have right here. Once again, you can use your micro oval pen and create some beautiful inner patterns like fragments or any feelings. So I try to enjoy just to create something like this. then I can thicken at the edges just create a double line thickening at the edges once again I turn my tile to my comfort zone and then I create these strokes towards me so now since we have completed this part let us create a new a tangle called moon pie it's nothing but an extension of crescent moon that we just added to the any corners with slight a bit of fun variations you know so I think we can even darken this space just ink it well it looks very interesting let's go we create these pearls and then just aura them can do something very simple as well now let us do add some shading I am just going to carefully add slight a bit of pencil in the aura okay so you can see that there is a um, like a well it is coming inside so at that kind of intersection I want to add some graphite so this might be our darkest area so there is no light resource or anything just going to play with what we feel 
will fit this. Just within that crevices. Now I'm going to add some bit of shading where these two brackets meet. You can add on both the sides or just on one side. slightly move my graphite to either sides I'm just paying slight a bit attention that the graphite don't enter and it stays right on this juncture only this we may lose all the white area right Now once again I take my pencil and I add graphite for these moon pies okay where there are too much of space just a little bit just to show a nice dark depth just playing with the light you know when winter comes I'll see you again Shine. I wish that I didn't have to wait Autumn leaves, please hurry Before I start to worry And his face gets blurry Wishes 
snow will fall and I'll be on your arm my love your smell still lingers as I close my eyes to set aside all this longing but it won't hide I dream about you 